How's it going, everyone? This is DJ. So you got your new on 4K streaming box plugged in. You're clicking around and you can't help it but feel like you're missing something. You see the basic apps, the standard layout, and you're thinking, is this it? You have a feeling you're only scratching the surface of what this box can do, and you're absolutely right. In the next few minutes, I'm going to show you how to truly unlock your on 4K device, get the apps that you really want, and turn it from a basic streamer into a full-blown entertainment powerhouse. So without any further ado, grab your remote and let's get right to it. All right, now in this video, I'm gonna be using the On 4K Pro, but the steps are gonna be the same for any of the On Stream boxes, no matter which one you have. And of course, if you have an Android or a Google TV device, these steps are going to be the same all right now the first thing we need to do here is go to the gear icon to the settings menu so we're going to scroll over now if you have one of the remotes that has a settings button on the remote you can just press that and we'll bring it right over here and then click on all settings in here we're going to scroll down to privacy we're going to go to the right scroll all the way down to the bottom click go to security and then go over to the right and we're going to disable scan apps with play protect now, the reason why we're doing this is if you download apps that are not part of the Google Play Store, most of the time you will get a notification telling you that it's going to be harmful and you got to do some extra steps over here to, to be able to install it. So by turning this off, you can avoid that. So once we turn this off, you can press the home button on the remote. All right, now we need to get another app from the Play Store. So you can go over to the magnifying glass over here. Now you can either come down here and type in downloader or you can just use the microphone on the remote and just say downloader. And there you go, it's the first one over here. Now just make sure you, you get the one that says downloader by FTV News. All these other ones are imposters, they're not gonna work the same. So you're just gonna click on it and we're gonna click on install. Just give it a second. All right, now that it's done, we need to click on open. Click OK. And then in here, we can press OK on the remote once. And one more time in the box here. We're going to change this to numeric. Now with the downloader app, you can type in a short code. You can put a whole URL or you can do a search. It's like a browser in here anyway. We're going to use a numeric code. This is going to bring you to my website, and the number will be 270-7470. Then we're going to go down to the OK button over here, click on it, and then go down where it says Go, and here we press Go. You're going to get this screen showing you where you're being redirected. And this is my downloads page on my website. Now, I will recommend adding this to your favorites. So the next time you want to install another app, all you gotta do is go to your favorites, click on the link, and it will bring it right over here. There's no need to remember the short code that I provided or what the actual address is, type it in. Just click on it, and it brings you right over here. To do so, you just press and hold the OK button, and click on Add Current Page to Favorites. And in here, click on save. All right. Now, while you're in here, just feel free to scroll through all the available apps that you can silo in here. You got a lot of different categories, a lot of different apps that you will find that will make your device a lot better. Now, it depends on what you're looking for. You will find it the most reliable ones in here. So you can just keep on scrolling. Now, to install something in here, if we go scroll down, we're going to install this app over here, the ES File Explorer. You can just click on download or you can click on any of the icons. It will download that file. So you just click on it. You're going to get this screen. It's going to download. Now it depends on your connection. It will go either slower or faster. 
And once it's done downloading, it will automatically stage it. And you're going to get this message over here. This is a one time setting that you got to change. And technically, this is the jailbreaking part. If I click on settings, you look for a downloader in here, turn this switch on. And that's it. You successfully jailbroken your on 4K streaming box. So now you can just click on install. It's going to stage it. And that's it. Now, we're not going to open this app. We're going to click on done first. And now you want to click on delete. You don't want to keep this installation file. There's no need for it. So make sure every time you install something, you click on delete to remove it. And then if we press the home button on the remote, you will see our new app is right over here. And it's ready to go. And that's it. In just a few minutes, you turn a standard on 4K box into a much more powerful streaming box. You can now install all kinds of new apps for movies, TV shows, utilities, and so much more. All right, so that should do it for today. If you guys have any questions, please leave it in the comment section below. Now we'll answer everybody's question as soon as possible. If you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up. It does let you two know you like what I do here, and it does help my channel grow. Thank you for watching. This is DJ. Till next time.